Alright, welcome back. This is him, dog. <clears throat> Whoa! Alright. I have uh, intentionally started this at a time where we've got a couple fish on. So you can see a couple fish being caught. We are carp fishing. So the point of this, oh my goodness. What is going on? The point of this video is carp fishing at amber without PVA. So there's oftentimes people are asking like, where can I fish when I don't have PVA unlocked? Which these days, when folks first get to amber, of course they don't have PVA unlocked. Even if they have like really focused on leveling up bottom fishing with premium, whatever, I don't think it's possible certainly very unlikely that you would have PVA unlocked. So it's always nice to be able to show off a spot where you can do really well on carp fishing without PVA. So we're using the Tutti Fruity Baits, single corn, well, double corn, not quad corn, double corn. I'll show you the setup in a minute. This is by far the largest fish I've caught here. We haven't fished here 24 hours yet, but we started in the morning and here it is evening. So the only thing that would be left is to test overnight. Obviously it's gonna be slower, probably not as slow as the middle of the day was, but also not as active as the, um, the morning was. The morning was absolute on fire, one fish after another. It's a nice little mirror. All right, let's get this back on out here in case we can, uh, in case we get one more fish before we wrap it up. It's not gonna be a long video here. I just wanna show you sort of um, the setups we're using. We're at 120, 155, by the way, 25 clip, 25 clip, and no PVA. All right, so we're using two hot hooks just to try to get a little bit nicer size carp uh, the bite rate definitely can sustain it. And we're using Tutti Fruity corn. See, two corn. And we're using Tutti Fruity. By the way, I did test quad corn. So two yellow and two red at the same time. Uh, or you could do four yellow. Uh, this is two red on the middle rod. And this is two yellow on the third rod. They're all, they all have two O hooks and no PVA, no feeding the water. Yellow and red corn have both been doing good. Doing quad corn on one rod worked fine as well. The bite rate was slightly slower than just having the two corn. So it might be worth testing it to see how it works for you. It's gonna be very similar. Either way, it is just very good fishing, uh, even without PVA, which I like a lot. Uh, especially for folks who are new to amber. Of course, this is a very well-known carp fishing spot here at amber on the uh, floating dock at 121.55. You do have a chance of rare carp out here. In the limited time I've been testing this spot, I haven't seen one, but there are definitely rare carps being caught here on both Tutti Frutti as well as a lot of folks still using that krill salmon uh, approach. Although with that, you probably need PVA to work well. So here we are on this floating dock, 120, 155. This is kind of what we've been catching. So in the morning, it was just one fish after another. I mean, if you look at this, like there's usually one minute between fish or two fish a minute, which is just insane for carp, right? But if you look at the weight, we had the one big mirror you saw, 7.6 frame. Everything else is less than that. A lot of fish between three and six kilog kilograms. Did I say meters? Kilograms. Um, so you're not catching huge carp, but you're catching like the amount of carp you're catching. So in just like 22 minutes of fishing, I had over 200 silver of carp. So your silver rate's really nice. Now in the middle of the day, it slowed down you know, pretty significantly. It went from like one fish after another to maybe one fish every five minutes. And then once it got to be evening, we've picked up again. I think at some point overnight, it will slow down again. But then in the morning, you should be good. I mean, you may need to let the spot rest every once in a while, 
Um, but you could probably get, you know, between one and two hours of fishing, do really well, and then let it rest for a bit, and then come back and rinse and repeat. The bite rate is good enough that even if you don't have PVA, you still have a pretty good chance, I would think, of um, leveling up your bottom fishing. Because you're just catching enough fish to, you know, keep having a chance of doing that. We are using... Um, we are using pop-up rigs to get that corn on there. And again, it's just working really well. It's always fun for a spot like this to be able to... Um, work without PVA. I mean, even if you don't have the spod rod unlocked yet, this is still a spot for you to consider. So um, definitely recommend it catching commons, frames, linears, and mirrors. So four really good species of fish and the chance of rares, 25 meter clip, 120, 155. No PVA, no problem. Come check it out. Tight lines, everybody. I'll see you next time.